I also saw recently you were on a very interesting um, workshop of AI, I assume. Yeah. yeah. Tell me more about it. What are the most innovative things you learned there and what you think could be very, very crucial to include in education in current times? So education is going to completely transform. Hmm. Education will go from a unilateral direction from a teacher to a student mm -hmm. to a, a bilateral conversation between a teacher and a student to C, yeah. a multilateral conversation between a teacher, student and an AI bot. That mm -hmm. is the internet. Mm -hmm. Now, that education system will be so powerful because you will have answers to all your queries. Like yes. you'll be amazed. I have deleted web browser from my phone because I only use chat GPT. I want specific answers mm -hmm. for every question that I have in my mind. My first reaction is I type it on chat GPT yes. and I get amazing answers. Mm -hmm. This is going to get a million times better in the next decade. Yes. Now that is the future of education and in AI. Oh my God, there's so much happening. You can't even imagine. I'll give you an example. There's my professor at Hong Kong University of Science and Technology is developing this very interesting platform that can predict a stock plummeting before it plummets. Okay. AI can help you predict a lot of things in the future hmm. by taking past cues and triggers. Hmm. So I think uh, I'll give you an example. Puri dunya mein 43 crore hearing disability ke log hain. 43 crore, 430 million people on the planet yeah. have some sort of hearing disability. Do you know how many sign language converters do we have in our country? Only, Hardly. only 370. Yeah. So uh, our student at Plaksha Prerit has created this AI bot that can convert anyone who's speaking hmm. live transcription into an AI bot sign language converter. This is so powerful. Like, I think AI is going to, and a lot of people think that Ritesh, you are just like saying AI. And yeah. I genuinely believe AI is going to transform everything on the planet. Absolutely. We it, see it happening absolutely. all over. And for our children, hmm. it is the biggest opportunity. 80 crore nokriya jane wali hai, ane wale 6 saal mein. And 40 new crore or uh, 400 million new jobs are going to get created for which we don't have skilled labor. Hmm. So if you want, if anyone wants their children to be extremely wealthy, extremely uh, successful, and if they have even slight interest in technology, AI yeah. is the way to go. You know, people have different thoughts. I'll tell you why. Yeah. So some parents think it's going to completely paralyze the next generation, the AI. Um, reason being, before we got exposed to AI, yeah. we had good like 30 years of our lives when we worked very hard. We yeah. learned from like literally from scratch how to do programming and got exposed to the uh, computers, the AI and everything. So we know the basics, the foundation of every program which we're using in current times. Now our children, they are being exposed to it from day, day one, one. Yeah. right? Yeah. So they don't know the reality and what everything goes behind developing such systems, such programs and do you think that will stop them from being more creative, more innovative and more experimental? I have a very different view. My belief okay. is AI is going to create so much time for children to do creative work because hmm. AI is going to shorten the time to execute some works. Example, yeah. an AI bot can typically edit videos for you in under two to three minutes. Mm -hmm. Now a task that used to take a designer say five to six hours. Now those five to six hours will be because AI will do things which are repetitive, which are mundane and humans can then use their time for deep creativity, mm -hmm. for public speaking, for uh, emotional intelligence, for building uh, ideas, for innovative solutions. Yeah. Humans will always be will always be ahead of AI, in my opinion, hmm. because humans have something that has come after millions of years of evolution. Yes. That AI, yes. AI, but AI will do things like mundane, repetitive things. Make you more productive. AI will make your tea 
hmm. ai will uh, already cleaning our houses houses so yeah. uh, ai will ensure and, and it it will be very personalized ai will ensure hmm. that and you only get the sunlight that you want so i think ai will be amazing for your productivity and ai will get you a lot of time on hand now the challenge in front of that is that because our children will not get will will not do all of this hmm. they will have a lot of time with them that time they will use to go on social media social yeah. media will lead to more depression that is why mental health pandemic will be the biggest uh, downside of an ai society and that is why finding true meaning of life is as a parent just do one thing find the true meaning of life for your child and the yeah. only way to do that a lot of people ask me is take them to every place and notice their reactions like i'll tell you my daughter i think she'll be an amazing dancer mm -hmm. like even without seeing she dances so well so i would really want her to explore that, that and yeah. that does not mean she becomes a dan dancer yeah. but i want to write down things and i write a letter to my daughter every quarter oh, and then i send i send it to her uh, email id that i have created and i think at the age of 18 she will get all of those letters yeah i'm documenting a her life b my life and i'm documenting every quarter what are the changes i see in the society hmm. so that she knows quarter by quarter how my life has been yeah now i think every parent should write a letter to to their sons how or daughters sweet, i'm sweet. telling you that is going to transform uh, that will really help the, your children hmm. to know your life and that is the only way and in that one of the letters i just wrote that i was born in a house hmm. that had no phone hmm. now if someone wanted to talk to my dad they had to call our neighbors yeah my neighbors used to shout and they used to be so excited yeah like a like <laughs> phone aaya and we used to be so excited and then my dad used to come back and we used to ask papa kis ka phone tha yeah and abhi duniya aisi hai ke wo matlab फोन छोड़ो वो सामने ही मतलब अभी थोड़े दिनों के अंदर टेलीपोर्टेशन हो जाएगी oh, yes. मतलब इंसान ही सामने आ जाएगा। I did a project on tel tele transportation, teleportation wow. in my college times, oh which my was God, like I don't so know, 15-20 years ago. Wow. <laughs> so I think soon it will be a reality, <laughs> which again to me sounds very scary, very but I don't know. The, the, the challenge with all of this is when, whether we like it or not, mm. it is going to happen. Now, yeah. either we can resist it is happening it is happening and yes it it will only get worse hmm. because by 2030 we are going to hit a computation level that will be so so bloody scary hmm. that if we if our children are not ready hmm. they're going to face the heat and that's why being a parent in this age is so hard yes and yes and mainly sabko ek hi cheez bol There's no one on the planet who can love you as much as your parents. Yes. Never doubt their intent. Absolutely. अगर वो डॉक्टर भी बनाना चाहते ना मुझे वो इसलिए था बिकॉज दे आर फेयर कि यार ऐसा ना हो कि मेरे बच्चे को ना कम पैसा मिले तो उनका इंटेंट तो एंड दिस यू रियलाइज व्हेन यू बिकम अ पेरेंट सो आज है ना आव्या गेट्स वेरी मैड एट मी व्हेन शी नीड्स टू बी वैक्सीनेटेड एंड शी क्राइज शी स्टार्ट्स थ्रोइंग थिंग्स अराउंड दैट आई विल नॉट गेट वैक्सीनेटेड बट स्टिल वी डू दैट So giving hardships to your children mm -hmm. is extremely important.